The pod squad, the, the full name of the pod squad is the Ragtag Pod Squad. It was just a bunch of people that were willing to help out, make sure that we packed, shipped, stored everyone's belongings when we got moved, or we were asked to move out in the spring. And it has really evolved into this team of just dedicated loveteers willing to help out a friend. A lot of folks, especially those who had left early and couldn't get back, were just really worried about what's going to happen to their stuff. And the fact that we were able to step in and uh, actually say, okay, here's what the plan is, here's your options, here's how things can get settled. Here we are, you know, six months later, doing like the last stages of the plan, <laughs> which is having kids pick up their things or moving it to their rooms before they move in in the spring. It's kind of like a mission accomplished feel. I've been incredibly privileged to help rally the troops. And basically what we're doing today is preparing for our remote students that will be moving back on campus in the spring by moving all of their stuff for them into their rooms so they don't have to worry about it when they arrive. The increasing workload is uh, sort of comforting because like you do know that uh, what you're doing will like mean that more friends will be coming back as well as new students will be able to welcome them onto campus so uh, us uh, seniors will actually be able to uh, meet them before we leave them uh, so that'll be a nice little it's nice it's just nice in general to know that people are coming back there's this just immense emphasis on community here at rice we look after one another whether that be uh, a close friend or a casual acquaintance. We really just want to make sure everyone is getting through tough times, okay. Whatever we can do to support them. I get made fun of by all the college presidents for being so extra with the pod squad. <laughs> but there's something very endearing about it. Uh, we're intrinsically motivated and these guys, these pod squatters, they're my friends for life. Like, we're not, we're not just teammates, we're friends. <laughs>